Uh, what's up, guys? I'm just trying to see if my, you know, recorder is actually working right now. Because I just, I this was like, this is my third take on the actual video. Because, you know, my recorder just is being dumb. But, <coughs> I do sound sick. I don't have COVID, but I have a very bad cold. And this is my first time I've ever been sick in a while. I'm drinking lots of, of water. But, just because I'm sick doesn't mean I can't do these these videos so I thought that <clears throat> why not you know go on to um, you know my uh, you know my whole entire uh, you know promise of basically reacting to Irv you know because of the fact that Irv has been requesting for me oh it's not very it, it's not connected to the internet hold on all right the internet's connected um, so I basically promised Irv, who changed his channel to EVP, that I would react to his album. This is like a special episode that I would react to his, uh, um, <clears throat> uh, as the full album for the Final Destination, as well as the song uh, Phrenic should have known. So I this was this just literally you know the Phrenic should have known literally just came out sh uh, nine minutes ago. So I thought, what's a better way? to you know pay child you know or try boot i should say because irv's a good guy he's gonna be on my you know i'm not gonna say anything he's gonna we we have a project coming um but you know i've been reacting to irv or the irv's a really good community member so he's also a good friend uh so i basically have been reacting to him i love his shit he's he's now on spotify which you know something i love so we're gonna check out should have known first and then we'll check out that album I still, even though I'm sick, I still am drinking strawberry lemonade. Because it's good as fuck, bro. Bro, why is the internet not going? <laughs> I don't understand this. Sorry, guys. All right, now it's working, guys. Let's go ahead and get to this. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to make sure that this is full volume. Let's get to this with full volume. Okay, so let's get to this full volume. Ooh, spooky. Oh yeah, just before we get into this, I believe this was uh, Trevor, which is one of... <coughs> I also cough a little bit, so bear with me on the part. I believe this is Irv. <coughs> um, uh, um, Mongarji, she's an amazing singer. And Trevor, which is, you know, one of uh, Irv's friends who is in his band, who's an amazing artist so far that I've heard. So uh, I think that's who is vocalizing right now. I love this, this, this spookiness. <laughs> You know what? I'm actually going to be playing. If I actually make, if Halloween comes and if COVID doesn't fuck up Halloween, I'm going to be, I'm going to be fucking building a, a fucking haunted house and playing this shit, fucking thing, bro. Because, you know, Irv makes some good fucking creepy ass music. Which is what I love. Let's give him a like, bro. <laughs> I love the spookiness. I love it. What is making... Is that an... What instrument is making this sound? Ooh. When you 
person is like, you know, seeing, okay. <coughs> oh, sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Sorry that you have to see this. I'm going to blow my nose, but it's, uh, oh, the three artists is Irvin V, DR, or D, Doctor, I think that's how you say it, and the Mongaduri, sorry, Mongari D. Um, it's an alternative trip hop RB soft rock trio's first single um, off of the first EP entitled Ferenic EP, or Ferenic, I think that's how you say it. The trio was formed by Irvin B, inviting Mongari to sing together with Dr. Lane, or Dr. Three, Lane's uh, down the instrumentals. This project is focused on soft, relaxed music for anyone who can get into it. While the EP does feature a sinister, eerie song, I love it. I love it. Most of the project is built with easy listening music. Oh, it is on Spotify. I'm gonna add that shit, bro. Okay, so let's get let's read the credits before we you know pause it and get back into it. So it was written by Irvin V, Wangura G, and Doctor Three. Produced by Doctor Three. Co-produced by Irvin V. Mixed and mastered or mixed and mastered by Doctor Three. DJ scratch by Irvin V. Vocals by Irvin V, Wangura G. Artwork by uh, Jada Dell. And it was released today um, <clears throat> on the twenty eighth. And it was also released by EVP, which I believe, if you guys do not know, you guys also should. Um... Oh, there's the lyrics. Is in the in the thing. Um, you guys should know that if you are an amazing artist, I thought about signing EVP, but I was like, you know, I do country, I do rap, I do. I'm trying to do metal. Um, once my voice gets better, better, better. Um, and I also do a lot of characters coming up with my music, and I also do a lot of. Uh, um, I do a lot of uh, special music i should say not really special music but i should say um <laughs> i forgot what i was gonna say <laughs> not really special music <coughs> but um music that has um you know cinematic emotional centrist like story. It's, it's one single story dripping throughout so that's why i was like you know what i might want to you know I, I, was, I was gonna sign up to ebp I'm just gonna be my own single single artist for all these, you know, through Cactus Cordell's, uh, or you know, his his little label, to um, you know, to this, to um, uh, Nason Entertainment, which is uh, um, that one dude's or uh, uh, Def Not Biles, you know, his his label. I thought about signing them, but then I'm like, you know what? If I do if I do sign anything, it might be EVP, but you know. I'm, I'm probably not going to because of the fact that, like, I just want to be my own artist, even with this independent, even through this, and even through these independents, you know, I want to be my own independent person. So, you know, that's, that's just, yeah. So before we get back into actually listening to it, um, let's look at the lyrics. Um... So, Irvin V, uh, when you betrayed you in hell, uh, know you've hurt, knowing you've hurt somebody, can you escape the fill of fill? You know, hell, can, can you escape the fill of hate? You know, move on like it was nothing. I've learned from bells, no, or from my mistakes, and I should stay. <coughs> I should stay on my own. I felt the pain, thinking they'd stay, but they just left. Now I know. Okay, good. Let's get to this shit. Let's rewind it. Harmonization and vocalization, that's 100%, bro. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, did you hear that laugh? It's like, yeah. <laughs> Sounds like vocalist. I love it. Oh, I love the two different voices.
This is a perfect... Bro, hold on. Hold on. If I ever do a short movie, which... Who knows? I got something up my sleeve. For an animated horror movie. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Who knows what's in the lab for me? For music, movies, videos. Who knows, guys? And... I might ask EVP for this to be one of the soundtracks because this is an amazing fucking sound, bro. It's an amazing sound. The vocalizations, it's like, you know, uh, I should have known, you know, like, what if, like, she, I could just imagine that, a scene of, like, a, you know, a, you know, I'm just gonna shut my mouth. Let's continue this. <laughs> Oh. I can't escape this love and hate you left behind on my own. I felt the pain thinking you'd stay, but you just left okay. me alone. I should have known I feel so strong after my loved ones leave me. I should have known they do me wrong and don't care if I'm breathing. This is amazing. This sounds good, bro. Oh, I'm gonna let it slide. Vocalization. You guys gotta you, you gotta teach me how to do that. I try to do it. Oh. Hip hop, bro. Oh, I love this sound. That was amazing, guys. That was fucking good. That was fucking good, bro. I love that, bro. I love that, bro. That was good, 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 bro. Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. So it's actually. <coughs> Oh, fuck. Hold on, I gotta take care of this, bro. I just gotta blow my nose, bro. But yeah, for real, that was fucking good, bro. You know, you know, verse one, and then the hook, and then verse one. Ooh, I love this. Let's read some of the comments. There's only, like, two comments there. 21 hours ago. Oh, so this must have been, um, you know. Um, I'm really loving this song. It just sounds... It sounds better uh, with every, it sounds better with every listen. Loving your voice with this one, Irvin, and don't uh, you don't just use your lower register enough. It, so it's great to hear that you're using it here. All the vocals sound awesome, and it's just uh, I just love the beat and the whole sound of the song. You're cool. Yeah, that's true. Everything you touch turns to gold. Damn, or uh, into into gold. Damn, there's nothing you can't do. Your voice in the background of the chorus, the harmonies are gorgeous, amazing. Yep, Irv is an amazing artist, bro, for real. You know, yeah, he's going to actually make it, you know, someday, bro. For real, though, you know. All right, guys, we're going to be doing a couple of the first, first actual half reaction to uh, Final Destination. And this one is supposed to be like actual metal from him. Oh, wait, 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 hold up, hold up. He's gonna bring. He's gonna bring some like heavy metal, fucking, you know, like. Ooh, that would be interesting. You know, that's Nightmare on Elm Street. For those of you who aren't horror fans, that's the, that's the intro. That's like the soundtrack to Nightmare on Elm Street. Let's get, I'm gonna plug in my phone, but let's continue this. This is gonna be interesting. I love Nightmare on Elm Street. One of my favorite movies. Or favorite franchise, I should say. I 
I was I, I was right. Before I head thing, I got to fucking blow my nose. I love this. <laughs> oh, I love it. Bro, that shit gives me creep, bro. This has got to go on Spotify. I'm sorry, bro. You got to put this on Spotify. This is going to go up. I'll go ahead and pause this. Pause, bro! My computer beats slow, but I'll go ahead and pause this and restart. Okay, guys. Um, I literally just had to, I, I am going to have to rewind it to get my reaction in there because I thought my fucking video recorder was recording, but it just, you know, doesn't record. Hey, bro, I'm feeling this. Hey, bro. That was lit. <coughs> that was lit. So to be honest, the first time I reacted to this, the video recorder didn't record. But I just had to go back to just show you that I can fucking... That shit fucking is lit, bro. I love it. When you can just sit there and jam out to the fucking music. And be on tempo with the music, you know, and feel it, bro. You could feel it in your bones. And for any of those who know, I get this because it's like rejected screams. For any of those, like I said in the previous uh, non-recording, uh, <coughs> for any of those who wanted to go and actually see, um, you know, because that was like the theme or the music for uh, Nightmare on Elm Street. And for those of you who haven't seen Nightmare on Elm Street, the reason why this song is called Rejected Screams it makes a lot of sense if you guys are confused because of the factor in the actual series you know freddy basically just you know it kills them in their dreams and so you know they're not really awake but they're screaming and there's no escape from them. so it, it it's really good i love that i love how Eric's doing this Like I said, I don't know if this is a soundtrack, us, um, or like I did say, I don't know if this is a soundtrack uh, song. Let me know, or. Oh. 
This is where I was at in the first recording. Oh. Hey, I love this. I love how he's screaming. You can hear it. Okay. <coughs> I may not be able to actually do it very well. Like, you know, I could get down to the lower vocals, but, <coughs> you know, and I don't know the actual terms or any of that shit because I'm still studying metal as well as studying lower and higher falsettos and notes. But if you can hear in the background, he's doing two different screams because he's like... You know, doing that roughy type of scream. I could just do it better because my throat's like fucking closed because I'm fucking mucus, but it's like, you know. <laughs> Don't get any wrong ideas. I was not an invitation for me basically saying that, I, you know, me sucking, you know, dude. <laughs> uh, but no, for real. Um, he, if you hear that, he's actually doing two different screams. And then, you know, the vocalization as well as the, the tune of the instrumental is bringing out to make it like feel like it's cinematic like it's epic you know sorry guys so people were just like they had to let the dogs out we'll go outside dogs let's continue the direction Oh no, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, oh, come on dogs, let's go play. So, oh, uh, the only reason why is because those dogs, their, their brains are little peanuts. Hey. Oh, that you could tell that was hard to do because just holding a singing note like ah, that's hard to do, but holding an actual fucking screaming note. Oh, my God, that's hard to do because you're stretching your fucking throat and your voice. What the fuck came in with fucking a hitter like da -da 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 -da. that BPM has got to be fucking high, though. Hey, feels like I'm getting shot at. Oh, oh, there it is. For those of you, I don't know if this is an actual hint to the actual movie series Final Destination, but this is the song Final Destination. That's what it feels like. In the movie series, a lot of people <coughs> die, and you know, you know, if you're on the list for being saved for the premonition from the main character, then you know, you never know if you're gonna die next, and like, you know, death comes at your door knocking like that. It's like, wait, is it gonna? And then you're just like, when it's not expecting, it's like, da -da 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 -da. you know. <laughs> I don't know if you did that on purpose or not. And don't worry, I'm not taking drugs. That was just a mucus pill. I'm trying to basic. Oh, it is drugs, but I'm trying to, you know, clear my nose. It helps with, you know, mucus. Ooh. Damn. Where's going and right now, bro? He's just like da 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 da. Let's go, bro. Hey. Hey.
Hey, that, oh. That vocal, or those, those instrumentals. Ooh. Damn, bro, was that you, Irv? Did you do that shit? That shit sounds good. That was good. I love that. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I like this. All right, before we get into the next uh, part, I'm going to go ahead and pause this part of the video and then get back into Okay, we're back, guys. I just had to make sure my uh, camera was actually recording because it does that sometimes where it's, like, trolling me. Ooh. I love this. This is the rock side of Earth. Damn, that is metal right there, bro. He's just like... Rrr, 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 rrr. Damn. Damn. Damn, bro. Ooh, the piano. I love this. He just like that temple change though. Damn. He's going back forth. I love this. I love the, the guitar. Gets me in a fucking mood though, for real. <coughs> Bro, that Code five S. So oh, we reacted to that, 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 and then first move, and then we got Code 5S, then we got uh, Sorrow Fate, then we got 19880721, Code Dreams, and then our Not To Allah. Uh, so, <coughs> we are going <laughs> to stop this special one. The next time, <coughs> sorry for me coughing, the next time that we do something like this, uh, or the second uh, special, I should say, for Irv. Um, we're going to basically be doing because he, you know, just got you know a thousand subscribers as well as five K followers on um, Instagram. So we are kind of celebrating that, and we are also basically uh, celebrating about his new album and that new single. That new single was awesome. Um, I like this rock type of thing. Um, now. The reason why I'm I'm not going to do it all in one video is because the 
um, production of it is just too much for gigabytes. Um, so we're going to be doing this in two parts. And then after I react to this, I'm going to be reacting to a couple of his other singles. Then I'll basically put every single project of his with mine, in my opinion, and then every single project I will grade. And that would be on the review. So this is just part of the herb specials. Uh, so go ahead and I'll say cheers, bro. Hopefully I get better well soon because I don't want me to be sick. Anyways, if you guys did the J pictures, if you love this video, give it a thumbs up, uh, subscribe, share to this, or share this channel, I should say, um, share this video. And if you guys are fans of Irv, go ahead and check him out, bro. Go ahead and give this video a like. And there's zero dislikes on it, and that's what I love about it. Um, um, if you guys are um, wanting to be, you know, second and third level member of Pixers, I got the Jerry Picks website up already now. Go and check that out. Soon I will get a Patreon and spot only fans up where you guys can pay and, you know, support me and donate, you know. Um, <coughs> And um, new merchandise coming soon. Speaking of merchandise, if you guys want to go get some merchandise, two links in the description below. One to a lot of shoes, one to Spreadshirt. So go ahead and check those out. Anyways, I'm Jim Rayford. I will salute you guys out. I am the name of my guy, I am the name of your guys' dreams. I will see you guys. I will see you guys later. Bye.